I was the quintessential Ned, wasn't I? Um, I'm very proud of it, but that voice, wee man, I'm glad it broke eventually. Run out, lads, eh? Well, all about the cameras is running out. It was a kind of whirlwind. I remember the first time I saw it, I really didn't like it. Um, not not the film, just I think because with Anne Marie and William, uh, who who played Chantel in Pinball, they had a bit of acting experience, and I think I just when I watched it, and it's something I don't think many actors kind of you're never keen on watching yourself, and I just it just really threw me watching myself, and then when I saw it on a big screen, and I sort of kind of backed off from just looking at myself all the time, I thought, yeah, this is really good. It, yeah, it feels like a long, long time ago, and when you say 20 years, man, that, that's scary. It was unbelievable. He, I mean, it's, it's one of them things you can't really explain to you day. I mean, just walking out of a red carpet, photographers swarming, everybody was screaming. It was, oh, it was amazing. Brilliant. It was quite... It was quite surreal. It was a lot to take in. Um, cause I, 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 right, there was one night we were at a party, our party, and I think Prince Albert of Monaco was there, and like Chuck Norris was there, and it was just like this is just just feels like a dream. In some ways, in my career, I'm trying to get back to that kid, you know, because when I when I was 17 and, and didn't know really what I was doing, I was fearless. And also, it's, it's a film I'm really proud of, and sort of it's something people of Scotland still sort of uh, mention to me.